Hoosier Ohio News Channel, leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local, dependable, on demand. And now, the latest from Hoosier Ohio News Channel. A new lawsuit names country band Sugarland as a possible defendant, and local Amish leaders want to educate their youth about the rules of the road. I'm Maggie Johnson. I'll have details on these stories coming up, but first, the retrial of a Garrett man accused of child molesting began Tuesday in DeKalb County Superior Court. 37-year-old Stephen Malik told the court that he felt coerced into confessing to, confessing to the crime in a videotaped interview last year. Jurors spent several hours yesterday watching that interview conducted by DeKalb County Sheriff Don Lauer, who then was an investi investigator in the case. The defense contends that the defendant was asleep at the time of the alleged acts and therefore not responsible for his actions. Malik also told the court that he felt uneasy about being placed in a cell with Jeffrey Kane, who was later convicted of murder and sentenced to life in prison. More testimony in the case will be heard today. A new lawsuit brought by the family of a girl who died in the stage collapse at the Indiana State Fair has named the country group Sugarland as possible defendants. 22-year-old Jennifer Haskell and her friend Elena Bigjani were among those killed in the collapse back, in August th back on August 13th. The suit names the band along with its agents and employees as possible defendants in the suit, which is just one of 21 lawsuits related to the stage collapse that have been filed thus far. So far, there have been no comment from any potential defendants in the case. Leaders in LaGrange County's Amish community feel it's necessary for more to be done to educate their youth about the dangers of the road. The move follows a recent crash that killed two young girls in Middlebury who were riding a horse-drawn car on a public road. A safety day in the Amish community has been suggested where youngsters could learn more from local police about the rules of the road. And that's the news for now. You can always find the latest news headlines right here on Hoosier Ohio and around the world at HoosierHioNewsChannel.com. I'm Maggie Johnson. Have a great day.